or Eddie, I'm not 100% sure. <sighs> hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with my most anticipated books for August 2016. I have a total of seven books that I'm going to be sharing with you. I tried to pick books that the popular booktubes haven't talked about yet, but we'll see how I did. Hopefully you find something that isn't that common. Obviously I have one or two that is pretty popular because, you know, hype is hype and it's gonna happen. So without further ado, let us get started. The first book that I'm excited for is It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover and it came out August 2nd, 2016, so it's actually already available to you. And this book follows Lily who meets a guy named Ryle and she becomes interested in him, only Ryle has a no dating rule. As they get to know each other, Lily quickly becomes the exception to this rule. As their relationship unfolds, Lily finds herself continually questioning herself and thinking about her ex-boyfriend named Atlas, who just so happens to re-enter her life. I read Colleen Hoover's Slammed and Point of Retreat. I really, really like Slammed. Didn't really like Point of Retreat so much. I have a review if you guys want to check that out. I've been wanting to read more of her work, and a couple of booktubers have read this book and said they really enjoyed it, so I'm excited to get my hands on it if I ever do. The second book I'm anticipating is Watching Eddie by Camilla Way, and this also comes out August 2nd, 2016. The book follows a girl named Edie, who used to be the girl everybody wanted to be friends with, but now at 33 she's working as a waitress and she is pregnant and alone. She quickly sinks into depression. That's when a friend of hers named Heather, who she hasn't seen in a few years, re-enters her life when she thinks that she needs her the most. And she quickly realizes that the people that you hurt deeply or who hurt you deeply never truly let you go, not entirely. And this book just sounds so cool. It's like a stalkerish kind of roommate thing. You know that movie with like Beyonce where the roommate's like insane? <sighs> I love that movie. So I'm very excited to pick this one up just because I'm getting those vibes. The next book I'm actually so excited about. I read the synopsis and I instantly was like, I need this in my life so badly. It's Behind Closed Doors by B.A. Paris, and it's supposed to come out August 9th, 2016. This book follows Jack and Grace, who seem to be the perfect couple. They're always together, never separated, and they end up hosting a dinner party for their friend. Grace's friends want to reciprocate the favor and host a lunch the following week, but only Grace knows that she will never attend this party. Her friends constantly call and are asking where she is and why she's not answering, and then they realize that things may not be as perfect as they seem. Sounds so cool. Well, the synopsis on Goodreads does a way better job than I just did. Honestly, look it up. I need this book in my life. It sounds just so thrilling, and I want to know what Jack is up to. That's all I'm going to say. I want The next book that I'm anticipating for the month of August is called Swear on This Life by Renee Carlino, and this also comes out August 9th, 2016. When a debut novelist named Jay Colby writes his first book, Emmeline is very excited to read it. Once she does, she quickly realizes that the storyline very much resembles her tragic childhood, which means that Jay Colby has to be her childhood best friend named Jace. She hasn't seen Jason over a decade, and instead of being flattered by him telling her story, she decides that she's going to go confront him, and it's basically the story of what happens next. Very excited to pick it up, because I really want to know what happens and if Jace and her are going to end up together, because I feel like it's a lovey kind of thing. I feel like it's going to happen. The next book that I'm anticipating is called The Girl Before. This is by Rena Olson, and it is also coming out August 9th, 2016. The book follows Clara Lawson, whose life is altered drastically in a matter of seconds when a group of armed men come into her home and take her daughter and husband away from her, and the last thing her husband says to her is, say nothing. Can we just take in how, one, how terrifying that would be, two, like, what is your husband talking about, don't say anything, like, sorry, what? I just think that that would be so traumatizing, and I want to know what happens next. The synopsis instantly hooked me, and I need this book in my life. The next book I'm excited for is The Widower's Wife by Kate Holliner. This is also coming out August 9th, 2016. The book starts off with a young housewife named Anna Bacon falling off a cruise ship and tragically dying, and the inspector who is assigned to the case quickly realizes that her death might not be an accident after all, and that a lot of people would do a lot of things in order to keep her secrets. The more 
he uncovers, the more he realizes that he might be in danger as well. Sounds super thrilling, and I want to know what actually happened to Anna, and therefore I need this book. And the final book that I'm very, very excited about is called The Couple Next Door. This is by Shari Lapena. This book comes out August 23rd, 2016, and I am so excited about this. The synopsis on Goodreads just instantly hooked me. This is what it says. How well do you know the couple next door, or your husband, or even yourself? People are capable of almost anything. A domestic suspense novel about a young couple and their apparently friendly neighbors, a twisty roller coaster ride of lies betrayal and the secrets between husbands and wives. If that does not hook you, I don't know what you're doing with your life, but me being a thriller addict, it's hooked me and I need the book. I need it. I need it. I know I've said this a million times about all of these books, but I need them all, okay? I just need them. Alright guys, so that is my most anticipated August 2016 books. Hopefully a couple of them you haven't heard about. I'm sure you've heard of the Colleen Hoover book, but you know, what you gonna do when popular booktubers read books too? So, I'm sorry, but hopefully you find something new to you. So I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!